Hello, loves. So, I want. Uh, <laughs> I've been um trying to not talk about this topic so much, but I felt I should finally address it on my channel. Um, and that is the the BS that is leaving Neverland. Um, I don't get people like. How can they be so ignorant and stupid? Like, I've never seen <laughs> people wanting someone to be guilty so much in my life. Like, I, I, I don't get it. Like, you would think they would be thrilled that Michael is actually innocent, that he actually didn't do any of this. Leaving Neverland was <laughs> made by two con men who have vivid imaginations. Who should, I don't know, like, I'm pretty sure, who I'm pretty sure are laughing their asses off at all these people that they've conned. At these gullible people. All Leaving Neverland, that's all Leaving Neverland did was just show how gullible people are. Michael Jackson is an innocent man. That man did not do one thing to those boys. He didn't do anything to anyone. He was just living the life, the, his life the way he wanted to. All right, so he had a, a, a a theme park in his backyard. I wish I had that. Like, you gotta remember, Michael started at five. He was five. Five years old. Okay? He didn't have a childhood like most of us. He didn't get to go out and play like most kids. He was stuck performing all day with his brothers. Like, rehearsing. That was it. So, like, him building that. He, but he also built it for kids that were sick and stuff. Like, that's one of the things I love about him. I I love Michael so much. He he is my <laughs> my most favorite artist because like he just he helped so many people. And I don't just love him because of the, I mean I love his music. Don't get me wrong. His music is friggin' amazing. It's it's literally the best. But I love him for just the amazing just the amazing person that he was too. Um and for people to make up these lies about him, it, it just, it frustrates me and it angers me because this man didn't do anything wrong. And for people to believe it, 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 <laughs> it makes no sense. It, 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 honestly, it, I mean, I knew there were stupid people out there, but leaving Neverland just proved my point, just, just made it even more known. Um, and the thing is, there's stuff out there enough information out there for people to do their research. So there's no reason why there should be this much ignorance on this. There's FBI files. There's freaking documentaries on YouTube. There's um, Square One. That's on the 93 allegations, if you really want to know about that, that Danny Wu did. There's Le Liza Leaving Neverland. And then there's Chase the Truth, which also, like, <laughs> shows his innocence. There... All you have to do is research and actually read the case and do do investigating. That's what you have to do. No documentary is going to convince me of anything, okay? Especially one that's one-sided. Especially one that's been debunked multiple freaking times. Wait, again, Wade and James are nothing but con men. They're nothing but con men. And anyone who jumped on this, you're just as bad. Um... I mean, the one seriously believes that he was molested in a, a train station that didn't even exist. How does that make any sense? If you seriously believe that, then you believe in, like, time travel. Which, again, hasn't been invented. <laughs> Somehow Michael was able to time travel then. And, what? Like, I watched Jurassic Park. That don't mean uh, <laughs> dinosaurs are uh, roaming around right now. <laughs> like, the heck? I don't know. I, I, I don't get it. I, I seriously don't get it. Um, Michael deserved so much better than what he got. He didn't deserve this. But, you know, there are people, there are greedy people out there, blood-sucking leeches who will do anything for money. And that's what they wanted. They only saw him as this cash cow, basically. Instead of a human being. And that's sad. Michael was a human being. Again, like I said in my my previous video about him, he wasn't a robot. He felt every damn thing that people were doing to him. So, like, 
Can you not? <laughs> um, the thing I love about Michael, it, again, he helps so many people around the world. Uh, but he also, like, wrote amazing songs that had good messages to them that preached about different things, different things that are going on around in this world that honestly should be talked about more than a silly documentary that's not even true. Um, like, it, it makes no sense, and people should just stop. <laughs> it also makes me question, like, did half y'all fail English? Because, like, now I remember when I had to write a paper or even a project for any class. Did, this just shows how, how much our school systems are have failed, at least in the U.S. and maybe the U.K., I don't know. But, like, now when I had to do a paper or a project, I remember we had to have thorough, we had to have thorough, like, sources. We had to thoroughly invest, we had to thoroughly research. We couldn't use Wikipedia, we couldn't use that. So, like, it makes no sense for some of these people. They use that, or they use MJ Facts, which uh, is equivalent to a tabloid. Just saying. Um... Also, do you notice that some of these people, that, especially the MJ haters, they're like, there's so much evidence that he's guilty and this and that, blah, blah, blah. And then when you ask them, they either resort to blocking you <laughs> or they don't give you anything. And I'm like, either be quiet or show me. And don't give me some tabloid, um, a link from a tabloid because that, that, that just shows your ignorance even more. Just saying. Um... But that just shows you that they, they have no idea what they are talking about. Or, like... <laughs> or or the, the famous... There was... There was uh, Michael, uh, Michael had child porn in his, like, his house or whatever. And I'm like, y'all do realize that's a felony. If they found any of that, he would have been in jail. He would have been locked up. They didn't find that. They had 70 officers raid Neverland. Again, a bit much, don't you think? But 70 officers... They didn't find one thing. Yeah, they found heterosexual porn, which I, I, I'm going to tell you right now, that is uh, normal for most male, for a lot of males. A lot of men have that. That is, that's pretty normal. That should tell you that Michael was into women. He is into women. He was into women. Um, you guys know that video, um, so especially NBA fans, you know that video where Whitney Houston is presenting an award to him? He's totally checking her out. You can tell the way he's staring at her. So that there, right there shows you. He was into women. Like, he was not into children. That's dumb. He wasn't a pedophile. Also, also he went to court. Like, literally, was on trial in 2005. For some reason, people don't remember that, I guess. I don't know. But was found not guilty 14 times. Acquitted 14 times. Not just one, but 14 because they didn't, they couldn't find anything. Um, the FBI investigated him for years. Um, didn't find anything. And that's how, invest I don't think you guys realize how investigations work. They investigate thoroughly. So like, um, but, and it's funny because like, even before I was a fan, because I, I became a fan, at, well, I started to become a little bit of like a fan in 2009, like before he died. And then like after that, that's when I, that's when I really, got into him and I feel bad but um in 2005 I remember the trial being on but for some reason I just knew that he was innocent I just had this this feeling you know I didn't get that creepy vibe off of him I just kind of knew you know and ever since I've been defending him I've always <laughs> defended him I was like no he didn't do it I don't know you know I just knew. I don't know. Maybe Sixth Sense? I, I really don't know. And this is before I even really became a fan, you know what I mean? I mean, I knew who he was, but I didn't know him, like, much about him. But I, um, I started to kind of listen to his music, um, before he died, because I remember listening to Number Ones, and then, um, that's when I started doing more and more research on him, like, after, and I, you know, here I am today. <laughs> but, um, and, I'm proud to be a Michael Jackson fan. I will always defend him. Um, because he was such an amazing person who did a lot for this world. And 
again, it saddens me and it's heart, it's heartbreaking to see what this world is doing to him, what this world did to him, um, what the media has done, did to him. But I think he's so inspirational and such an amazing, was an amazing strong person, even though I know there's probably times he maybe wanted to give up or couldn't handle it, but he was strong. At least he showed it. Um, and I think these people that are lying on him, they're nothing but evil scumbags with no lives. Um, I'm sorry about Wade and James. Y'all need to learn how to get a job. That's what most normal people do when they're having money issues. They get a job. That's what they do. They don't um, turn their backs on their fr uh, on a friend who was there for you. Just saying. Um, but yeah, I love Michael so much. And I wish people would stop with this now. It's getting so old and... S it, 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 yeah. But, um, Michael, I love you. I am so sorry for <laughs> all that you've been through. You seriously did not deserve it. Um, I don't, I don't get it. But, yes, this was my video. <laughs> Again, I try not to talk about this, but I had to. I couldn't keep quiet anymore. I couldn't I had to address it. <laughs> um. But no, I, I love Michael. I think he's an amazing human being, sweet person who just, you know, did amazing things. Um, again, I'm, I'm proud to be his fan. I am proud. I, <laughs> I will say it because um, he has helped me through so much and I wish I could, I can't thank him enough for it, but um, he's changed my life in so many ways and I, I'm, I'm, I'm thankful for him, but um to all these people, can y'all stop? Like, can you stop being ignorant for five seconds? Like, actually do research. Michael Jackson is innocent, okay? Get over it. You're not gonna find it. Y'all lost, okay? Like, stop it already. <laughs> but, um, I love you guys. The, again, love you, Michael. This, yeah. <laughs> love you. Mwah.